crazy? I was, I was crazy, crazy once. They locked, locked me in a room. room. A rubber room. A rubber room, a rubber a rubber room, room with, with rats. rats. And rats, rats make me crazy. crazy. Faith, the fabled Xbox 360 in North Gen 2. And when I started this, the only kernel I could find was a 2.6 kernel, roughly 13, 14 years old. Yeah, I'm trying to get that to work in the modern era. It's not going well. And actually spawned off a series of me trying to get modern Gen 2 to work on uh, x86. Check out. I remember to add a video card for it later on. But later on I found a free, uh, version 3 kernel. And then even further on, a 5.12 kernel was released, so things are getting good. Now, while the Xbox 360 is a lot faster than some of the other systems I've run, it does suffer a very weird bug, where if you, um, on certain loads to the uh, all six cores, or all six threads even, it will just hard lock and freeze, so compile and software on this is an absolute pain. Yes. This bearing in mind was my first real project to trying to get Gen 2 to work on a console. So, yeah, it wasn't the best of the times of experiences and I highly recommend people don't run this one. Uh, so you're probably wondering how you get Linux to run on an Xbox 360 if you've got one. Well, unfortunately it's not very easy to do. You need to have it um, hacked with a JTAG or a reset glitch. You need to be pretty good at soldering, you can't just soft mod it like other consoles, fortunately. So the barrier to entry is quite high. And then the other sad part is the old 360 that's free with a FREE60, I know, great name for a community, is basically dead now. So getting involved basically means you're on your own. Don't really want to start this one up at all. But if you did want to do it, does work and here is the proof of that so yeah why it caused me a lot of suffering and a lot of pain i kind of imagine you lot like me suffering so i'll uh, try what the other youtubers do if if this video gets 250 likes i'll restart this and actually get into working on it and make an actual live cd for people to use and get involved if they've got a reset glitch we could see if we could actually revive the 360 scene back up but yeah thanks for watching um mainly just to showcase i have got a playlist of this if you want to see that uh, of all the suffering that i went through but until then keep compiling